Okay, ladies and gentlemen, our 10th contest of the evening is in the Fight UK Bantamweight Division. Fought under 135 pounds. Here I am with Gaz Spitfire Pilot. Gaz is an undefeated prospect from Manchester Predators, and tonight he's fighting on our pro card. Gaz, how are you feeling today, mate? Yeah, I feel really good. Excellent, excellent. Um, as we were just discussing there before, I've seen you rise through the amateur ranks from the, uh, the, 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 the lowly days in Birmingham on a couple of those amateur shows, and obviously you're now an undefeated pro fighter. Um, how have you prepared for this particular contest? Um, I studied my opponent, I've watched him fight. And, uh, I, didn't, I didn't really mix anything up in the training, just hard training all, all year round. Nothing, nothing different. Yeah. Well, obviously, you know, Manchester Predators, you've got a good reputation. You've got some solid guys up there. I would assume they've been putting you through your paces oh, yeah. and beasting you. Every time, man. Even without a fight. Even if you just pop into say hello, you're getting put through your paces. <laughs> you know what I mean? like, everyone there is solid, as Phil said. Like, or even the amateurs and like, the first time fighters and stuff are pushing, pushing the pros and stuff like that. So everyone's helping each other out. And the coaching, the coaching there is a next level. Like, with uh, Gary Boardman and Will Burke. Good, coaching, so. good stuff. Well, look, uh, guys, you seem very, very confident. And again, like I say, undefeated prospect. So I would assume you're, you're looking to keep your zero tonight. Well, that's the plan, eh? <laughs> <laughs> well, look, all that's left to say, mate, I wish you the best of luck for this evening. And I look forward to seeing you in the cage putting on a good show tonight. Cheers, man. Here I am with Martin Sheridan. Uh, Martin trains out of Shudan over in Northampton. Uh, Martin is six and three, fighting on the pro card. He's a veteran of fight MMA. Um, you've probably seen him before if, you're, uh, if you've seen the shows before. Martin, how are you feeling today, mate? I'm feeling good, feeling confident, ready to go. Excellent. Well, obviously, I've seen you fight several times before. You always bring a, a good fight to the good fight to the cage. You're always entertaining. Uh, do you know much about your opponent tonight? Uh, yeah, thanks. Uh, yeah, he's a he's a ground guy basically, from what I've seen of him, from what. I now he's, he's a purple belt in jiu-jitsu, so I'm going to probably try and keep it standing. I've got a black belt in kickboxing, so it makes sense to keep it standing. Excellent. Well, it sounds like you've prepared well. It sounds like you're going into it with your eyes open and you know what's what. Obviously, we're looking forward to you putting on a, a good show again tonight, mate. So all that's really left to say is I'll wish you the best of luck for tonight, and I look forward to seeing you in the cage. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He hails from Manchester. He's 26 years old, stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, and weighed in at 135 pounds. He fights for Manchester Predators and has a mixed martial arts record of five contests, four wins and one draw. Let's hear it for Gaz Spitfire Pilot! And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, he hails from Wellingborough. He's 30 years old, stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, and weighed in at 135 pounds. He fights out of Shudan, and has a mixed martial arts record of nine contests, six wins and three losses. Let's hear it for Martin. The Silencer Sheridan! Professional bantamweight action about to get underway here at Fight UK 10. Gaz Pilot in the yellow and black shorts taking on local favourite Martin Sheridan in the black and grey shorts. I'm David Leatherby. Alongside me as always Ben Cartledge and Ben. Martin Sheridan, a guy we've seen a few times, and Gaz Pilot, a guy we actually both judged recently at ECC1. Fantastic ground game. He took out James McGuinness on that occasion. Looks like a decent matchup, this one. A really uh, high level Bantam weights here. Sheridan, a guy we've seen, like I say, fight a featherweight, made the trip down to Bantam, six and three. Um, fought a lot of tough guys. And Gaz Pilot, like you say, David, people maybe say a, an untidy style, but it is so effective. Yeah, a real dark horse, Gaz Pilot, and a, a name that's really flown under the radar, I think. He's got a Yamato win over the likes of Pietro Menga. He's got fantastic grappling pedigree, and uh, taking out James McGuinness at ECC was an excellent result for him, and I, I think he'll look to get this one down to the deck. Sheridan's got some good stand-up. You mentioned the losses, but they've come to tough, tough guys, the likes of James Savile, who he gave a few problems on the feet, landed a few, uh, a few shots, so... I think it, we are looking at a striker versus grappler matchup again. And uh, Pilot has got a very, very tough top game. Sheridan's going to look to keep this one at range and use his tie, which is excellent. And Sheridan, as we've seen it before, Davey, 
really got that fighter's heart and spirit, never gives up. We all remember that fight of the year candidate he had back at Fight UK 5 against Dean Truman. What a still to me probably stands out as one of the, the, the greatest fights I've ever seen live and, and showed him there that he could come back uh, withstand a tremendous amount of punishment, could deal with a, a tough wrestler and uh, use his submission attack and use his Muay Thai. And to be fair, that's what he's going to have to do against a, a tough guy like, uh, like Gaz Pilot. Yeah, extremely tough customer, Martin Sheridan. Always sells a lot of tickets, got a lot of fans. But this is where he doesn't want to be with Gaz, the Spitfire Pilot, on top of him. This is a position that Pilot's been in a lot in his pro career and just looking to chop that elbow down as i said ben it was a it was a real uh, show of grappling last time out and he, now he's looking to take the back dangerous times for martin sheridan looked like he was going to be able to shake him off but pilot did very well in sneaking through that other hook and now the standing batman position as he goes to fish for the fish for the rear naked choke sheridan to be fair though like i say they very well schooled six and three as a pro so stepping in here for the tenth time Walking his man over to his corner. And very, very savvy. Like I say, that's, those yeah. are the kind of uh, responses that you get from a, a, a pro with like that many fights. Didn't panic when he was in a tough position. Calm as you like, piggybacked his man over. And now his corner really helping him out, telling him about which arm to isolate, etc. Yeah, fantastic work from Sheridan. Because like you say, the corner can see things he can't, especially with Pilot on his back. So fantastic work from Sheridan there. Just a real, uh, real old pros trick. Great work. But the fact of the matter remains, there's still a lot of time left in this round, Ben. And with Pilot on your back, looks to go, maybe looking to go palm to palm. That's what his corner's calling for. Sheridan really struggling here. Pilot's done well to negotiate this to the canvas. And he's got that choke That's in. Tight. It's under the chin. That looks very, this very tight. This she wrote. Sheridan, Sheridan really and gets the tap. the tap. Wow. Fantastic performance from Gaz Pilot. I said, Ben, he's flown under the radar, so to speak. But wow, what a statement from him. Moving on to 5-1. and one. Well, 5-0-1, oh I think, as a pro. Got to be a prospect people are looking at, Ben. Very much so. You're right. 5-0-1, oh that one being the draw that came against Jamie Nolan. I mean, a great prospect moving forward. One that a lot of people will be talking about. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, after three minutes and 23 seconds of the very first round, your winner due to tap out by rear naked choke from the blue corner, Gaz Spitfire Pilot. But let's hear it for a very worthy challenger. Let's hear it for Martin Sheridan. So, ladies and gentlemen, here with your winner, Gaz Pilot. Guys, a, a very tough fight, very physically grueling fight. Were you expecting that kind of fight from a tough guy like Sheridan? I was hoping for a fight like that, obviously, because it went my way. I've got nothing but respect for Martin Sheridan. He's a great, he's a great uh, competitor in the sport. And he's, uh, he's sort of fight with me, and I can't thank him enough. What a guy. Uh, it's a quick turnaround for you as well, guys, because not but a couple of months ago, you were fine. You were racking the wins up now. I mean, how far do you think you can go? Are you, are you feeling that you can keep this streak going and really make a push in the bantamweight division in the UK? Well, that, that's generally the idea, but you never know how it goes. Every, every opponent you fight is a challenge, so it could go either way any time, so. And finally, just to wrap it up, is there anybody you'd like to give a shout out to? Any training partners just about the camp that you've had? Yeah, of course, man. I've got my coaches, Gavin Boardman and Will Burke. Will Burke couldn't make it tonight. He was at another show calling some other lads. Got Abby Jack and McConnell. All my training partners, Phil Flynn, Rob Sinclair, Mick Sinclair, Deck Williams, Mike Berry, um, there's, there's so many, Moggy, there's, there's too many to mention. Not to forget me, my girlfriend Liz, she's, she's like a rock next to me all the time and helping me for everything. Um, and also my parents and all my family. And my sponsors as well, don't forget them. Thanks very much. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it for your winner, Gaz Pilots.